the list on Thursday nights. So I wanted to let you know that there's some beautiful holiday fashion in your future. Uh, 5 p.m. Monday night, 5 to 7 p.m. is my holiday collection. So all these pretty things I've been wearing will be part of that special show. Okay. How cute is this? This one is up and going. We've got the roller coasters. Do you see them going up? Here, I want to get the camera to catch that. Do you see them going up? I do. Up, up, so up. this is a replica of the original World's Fair roller coaster. And it is just unbelievable. Oh, and is that cute? Oh, and it goes one car at a time. One car <gasps> at a time, and you can see their hands are up, they're excited. You know, there's something so special about collecting something that is from the past. Uh, if, if you grew up just loving roller coasters, if you love having that conversation <laughs> with your children or your grandchildren, this is from the World Fair collection. So wow. we have a beautiful Ferris wheel in the background. We have this roller coaster. Colleen said to me, when exactly did roller coasters and Ferris wheels come yeah. out. When late was the 1800s. original World's Fair? So late, the late 1800s. The original no World's kidding. Fair, well, the, the first big fair like that was in France, and then the World's Fair okay. was in England, and it was oh. always about countries coming together to share their inventions, their innovations. And so having the amusement park was one of them. And then look at how all of this is hand painted. We've got where. This is amazing. Yeah, where they can actually load up on the dock Just there. The cars are so fun. I mean, all the people, they're in little different all outfits the people. and colors. And each car has four little participants here, and they're having a ball. I their mean, hands are up, their, their hands up. are going up. It and is then just you also have the you have the fairground, but you also have the uh, arcade that has the red and white striping. You can actually see the paneling on the boardwalk. You can see all of the detail, all the tiny people, the LED lights. It's fantastic. The presence on this. Now this is 17 inches tall. It's eight inches deep and about 16 inches wide. Just to give you an idea, if this was something you wanted to display on a narrow shelf or a mantle. Oh my gosh. It's so much fun. And this is something a lot of you will keep this out all year round, not just for the holidays. By the way, when you look down below, I mean, look at all the little people here. Right. See the people walking along the boardwalk. There's flags and there's a little and fence going there's around. There's 50 songs, Colleen. Look at the LED lighting that's going on that is illuminating that you and I are not able to see from the back. It has 50 different songs. 25 are more classic Christmas classics. Right. And then 25 are American Beloved classics. So I love that. So 25 holiday songs and then 25 American classic songs. That's why it really is a year round. Your children will be fascinated. It brings out the child in all of us if you love roller coasters. And if those of us that remember, you know, that were around 100 years ago, and I mean, this has been around a long time since the 1800s, the original design, but the point is, this will remind you of those old fashioned roller coasters. What a cool treat this is for your home, for the fun. If, you if you're a collector, or you just wanna create the most adorable vignette somewhere, I mean, it's just too cute to pass up. You probably know the person who is very uh, into collecting items like this. Maybe you have a history buff person in your family and, they, and they're very innovative and they love the idea of having collector's pieces like this, heirloom pieces. This is all hand painted. This is all put together by hand. That's yeah. why they are truly limited editions and there aren't so many of them. And then remember, all of the little cars are being propelled and held down through uh, magnets. This is all magnetized. Uh, I wonder about beautiful? that. Yeah, it's really pretty. nothing's falling off here yet. No, nothing's falling off. And I, just, even how they're going up the strip, and so here you go. Yeah. Let me turn this to the side so that you can see they're all in the lineup going up. So guys, it's $199.95. We have it on five flexible payments. It's free shipping if you've already spent $5 on shipping today on any of the Duck the Hall items. So take advantage of that. The detail is remarkable. I have to say, it kind of blows your mind how beautifully this is such a collectible collectible collectors out there this is an absolute must because it's absolutely fascinating this reminds me my uncle dave god rest his soul used to have a hole in his little office den when we go to yes. his house he lived on um, forest lake in minnesota and he had all these cool kind of interesting little old-fashioned toys and things and as little girls we go visit uncle dave and aunt marilyn and we were 
riveted. You're mesmerized. I mean, fascinated. And you're still remembering it. Oh, and totally. Being able to share those oh, stories. those memories. Your little ones would have that forever. You're right, right. I mean, if when the grandchildren come over, or if your little nieces and nephews come over, and you just had this little fantasy little playland. I mean, how cool. And what about the kids today? You know, out of the mouth of babes, they would say, you know, what is that? That's the type of roller coaster you used to have, Daddy. Right. It didn't go upside down. It didn't do this <laughs> or do that or, or spin around through water. Hey, these are no. pretty, pretty scary. They used to, well, I, I think so. Obviously, they didn't have the speed that our roller coasters have to have today, but they had to start somewhere. And I love being able to share those stories with children, get those conversations started so that they are intrigued. But just aesthetic. It's so beautiful. Yeah, and it just plugs right into any standard household outlet. She's playing the music for you. Remember, you can play holiday music, or you can 25 holiday songs, or 25 classic American classics. So depending on the season or the mood, you can change up the music. It's all right there. The little controls are right there at your fingertips. I do have to say, I love that this does it because when we met before the show, mm -hmm. and you're telling me about this roller coaster, and here's what's going on in my head: Where the heck am I going to put a big old roller coaster? I, I don't know what I'm. To do with it. I'm thinking this sounds adorable, but I, I, in my head, I'm like, it's going to take up a ton of space. No, no, no. That's what I love about this is Perfect that it's size. so ornate and it's so special, but it's easy to decorate with because it does not have a huge footprint. 16, or what is it, 15 and a half by six and a half by 16 and a half. So it's a perfect size on any little table, end table, coffee table, on a buffet, wherever you decide to put it. You can move it around, right? I'm thinking in my head, like, Mouse trap. <laughs> Remember, like the you know, this you're, you know, you're probably thinking pieces. Uh, the crafting room of a man or or his man cave where he's got the large right. helicopter right. or even the train set. I will say it's probably that person who will appreciate oh, something sure. like that. The person who's going to appreciate what went into the artistry and the quality of the materials and, and how all of this was exacted and perfected to replicate a very real roller coaster from you know time-honored past, from, from, from our past. So that's the person that will probably yeah, this most is, appro this appreciate this. This is a replica this. of the original World's Fair roller coaster. So you have a piece of history here. It just invokes conversation yes. for storytelling, keeps that child alive, brings back wonderful memories. If you'd like to order yours, it is new, it is available, and the Ferris wheel.